I'm Kim Coleman, a co-founder here at Paid Memberships Pro. Let's continue setting up Paid Memberships Pro by taking a look at some design options to customize the appearance of the front end of our site. I'm gonna just show you our account page to show you what we're currently working with as the default in Paid Memberships Pro. So this uh, is using our variation, that's our default variation of our style. We have another option you can choose from, which I'll show you in a second. But this basically is a rounded card with a subtle background. And you'll see on our checkout page, our button is a dark blue color. If I navigate to Memberships, Settings, Design, you'll see some other options here. This is our default recommended option. We also offer this high contrast color scheme and layout, which is really squared off borders and a high contrast color scheme for your site. Or you can choose to load the minimal styles and just leave everything to your theme or a custom style sheet. That's totally up to you. If I switch it to high contrast here, we'll just take a peek at what that looks like on the front end now. You'll see it's more these squared off boxes. It applies everywhere through the site. So here on my membership levels page and through to my checkout form as well. We can also adjust our design settings to change our colors. So the base color is the color used as the background of these cards. The contrast is the color used for the text and the accent color is used for buttons. So let's say our site's accent is more of a green. We can adjust that here. And you'll see on your checkout page, that button is turned to green. Some sites use an inverted color scheme. So let's quick take a peek at what that could look like. I'm going to, this isn't part of Pay Memberships Pro, but in my theme, I just wanna adjust us to a color scheme that has that inverted background so we can see what's that gonna look like with Paid Memberships Pro. So here's our checkout page. You'll see now our text, it's not great right now, what it looks like. So let's change our scheme. Here, we'll change our base color to be like a dark black color and make our contrast a white color. If we click Save Settings and come back, you'll see now we're using that inverted scheme on the site. There's always be a little bit of work that people need to do if they're going on this dark mode like this, but far better than we ever used to be with these design settings and giving you very simple color controls to invert the color scheme and have white text on a dark background. You still wanna check it for accessibility. The Paid Memberships Pro itself tests good for color contrast with the WordPress 2024 theme default color scheme and default design choices in our settings. When you start to customize them, you'll be responsible for adjusting the color contrast ratio so that you're still meeting accessibility minimum requirements. So that's design settings. I'm gonna put this back to what I like it to be. We don't have a revert option, but you can do that here yourself. I gotta go to the end of this here. Here we go. There, and uh, the green's fine. We can keep it, let's go. We were like a deep blue, we'll put it back there and click save settings and I'll just undo my site, put it back to the default color scheme here in this 2024 theme. There, back to normal. Yep. So play around with these design settings and the options that you have here. Choose that default scheme if you like the soft rounded corners with the subtle drop shadows, high contrast if your site's a little bit more square, modern, edgy. And then if you need it to go minimal, if you don't like what's going on here, just load the default styles. That just validates that your site's going to actually function uh, for any of our custom um, CSS selectors that you need. But I hope most sites are liking the default scheme. And really, you just might want to adjust this accent color to your site's button color, accent, action color of choice. Mm -hmm.